The Theory of Eternalism 1. Introduction Eternalism, a fascinating and thought-provoking theory, challenges our traditional understanding of time and our place within it. This video delves into the depths of eternalism, exploring its origins, key principles, and profound implications across various disciplines. By examining the nature of time, the philosophical concepts it entails, and the debates surrounding free will and personal identity, we aim to provide a comprehensive overview of this intriguing theory. Additionally, we will explore criticisms, applications in physics and cosmology, and potential future developments, shedding light on the ongoing discourse surrounding eternalism. Join us on this intellectual journey as we unravel the mysteries of eternalism and its profound implications on our perception of reality. The Theory of Eternalism Eternalism, not to be confused with the endless pursuit of youth, is a fascinating philosophical theory about the nature of time. It challenges our conventional understanding of time as a linear progression from the past, through the present, and into the future. Instead, Eternalism suggests that all moments in time are equally real and exist concurrently. 1.1 Historical Origins of Eternalism Eternalism has roots in ancient Greek philosophy, with philosophers like Parmenides and Zeno contemplating the nature of time and change. However, it wasn't until more recent times that the concept gained traction and a fancy name. In the early 20th century, philosopher J.M.E. McTaggart introduced the notion of a block universe, which laid the foundation for eternalism as we know it today. 1.2 Definition and Scope of Eternalism In a nutshell, eternalism asserts that past, present, and future are all equally real and exist as concrete entities. It paints a picture of time as a vast four-dimensional block where all events, from the Big Bang to your last embarrassing moment, coexist. Eternalism challenges our everyday perception of time as a linear flow, urging us to embrace the mind-boggling idea that everything that ever was and ever will be already exists. 2. Key Principles and Concepts of Eternalism Now that we have a rough grasp of eternalism, let's delve into some key principles and concepts that make this theory tick. 2.1 The Block Universe Theory Imagine time as a solid block, with every event represented as a point in this four-dimensional object. According to Eternalism's Block Universe Theory, the entire history of the universe is simply a spatially extended structure within this block. So, the time of the dinosaurs, Shakespeare's plays, and hipster beards are all just different locations within this temporal block. 2.2 Four-Dimensionalism and Time as a Dimension In Eternalism, Time is not just a linear sequence, but a dimension, much like the three dimensions of space. This four-dimensional perspective allows for a unified understanding of all moments in time, challenging our intuitive experience of time's flow. It implies that everything that has ever happened or will happen is already fixed in the block universe. 2.3b Theory of Time and Eternalism Eternalism aligns closely with the B theory of time. This theory rejects the notion of a privileged present moment and suggests that all moments in time are equally real. On the other hand, the A theory of time, which eternalism challenges, views time as a series of distinct and successive moments with a special present moment that moves through them. 3. Understanding the nature of time in eternalism. Now that we have a foundation in place, let's explore deeper into the nature of time within the realm of eternalism. 3.1 Presentism versus Eternalism Presentism serves as eternalism's prime antagonist. Presentists believe that only the present moment is real, while the past is gone and the future is yet to come. Eternalism's perspective, however, argues that all moments, past, present, and future, are equally real and coexist within the block universe. 3.2 Temporal Becoming and the Illusion of Flowing Time Eternalism flips our perception of time on its head by suggesting that the flow of time we experience is nothing more than an illusion. Instead, all moments exist in their own right, independent of our experience. Our sense of time passing is merely a result of our consciousness moving through the block universe. 
3.3 Timelessness and Time Travel in Eternalism Timelessness is an intriguing concept that arises within eternalism. Since all moments exist simultaneously, there is an argument to be made that time itself does not flow but rather provides a canvas for events to occur. Furthermore, the idea of time travel becomes a captivating possibility within the eternalist framework, as every moment already exists, waiting to be explored. 4. Exploring the implications of eternalism on free will and determinism. The mind-bending implications of eternalism extend beyond theoretical musings to impact our understanding of free will and determinism. 4.1 Compatibility of Eternalism with Determinism Eternalism and determinism make good bedfellows. If all moments in time exist concurrently, the future is already fixed, leaving little room for genuine free will. From an eternalist perspective, our choices and actions are predetermined by the entire structure of the block universe. 4.2 Challenges to Free Will in an Eternalist Framework Eternalism presents a challenge to our cherished belief in free will. If all moments in time are equally real and predetermined, it raises questions about the true nature of human agency. Are we truly making choices, or are our actions simply playing out within the confines of the block universe? 4.3 The Debate on Moral Responsibility and Eternalism The implications of eternalism on moral responsibility are highly contested. Some argue that if the future is already determined, individuals cannot be held morally responsible for their actions. Others suggest that even within a predetermined framework, moral responsibility can still exist, as individuals are integral parts of the grand tapestry of the block universe. In a nutshell, eternalism challenges our everyday understanding of time, suggesting that all moments, past, present, and future, exist simultaneously. It raises intriguing philosophical questions about the nature of time, free will, and our place within the universe. So, next time you find yourself pondering the fleeting nature of existence, consider eternalism and embrace the mind-expanding possibilities it presents. 5 eternalism and the philosophy of personal identity 5.1 identity persistence across time in eternalism when it comes to personal identity eternalism throws a wrench into our traditional understanding of time according to this theory past present and future events all exist simultaneously so how does this affect our understanding of ourselves over time in eternalism, our identity persists across time through a series of temporal parts. Think of it as a collection of snapshots of who we are at different moments in time. These snapshots, or temporal parts, make up our entire existence. It's not about a continuous self, but rather a collection of moments that together form our identity. So, if you've ever wondered who you really are, just know that you're a combination of all the versions of yourself that have ever existed and will exist in the eternalism framework. You're like a collage of past, present, and future selves, all stitched together to create the tapestry of your existence. 5.2 Psychological Continuity and the Self But what about our sense of self and the continuity of our personal experiences? Eternalism has an answer for that too. It introduces the concept of psychological continuity, which focuses on the continuity of our mental states rather than the continuity of a singular self. Psychological continuity suggests that what makes us who we are is the connection between our thoughts, memories, and experiences. It's not about a fixed identity that remains unchanged, but rather a fluid and evolving sense of self. So. Even if you look back at your past self and cringe at some of the things you did or believed, remember that it's all part of your journey of psychological growth. In eternalism, personal identity is like a river flowing through time, constantly changing and adapting. You may not be the same person you were years ago, but that doesn't diminish the richness and complexity of your existence. 5.3 Implications for Personal Identity and the Afterlife now, let's dive into the afterlife, shall we? Eternalism has some intriguing implications for our understanding of what happens to our personal identity after we shuffle off this mortal coil. If all moments in time exist simultaneously, then it follows that our existence transcends the boundaries of our physical lifespan. 
In other words, eternalism challenges the notion of a linear afterlife where there's a clear beginning, middle, and end. From the eternalist perspective, our afterlife is not confined to a specific sequence of events. Instead, it encompasses all the moments of our existence, both past and future. So, in a way, our afterlife is an eternal continuation of who we are, with all our temporal parts forever existing in the grand tapestry of time. So, whether you believe in an afterlife or not, eternalism offers a unique way to ponder the nature of personal identity beyond the limits of our earthly existence. 6. Criticisms and Challenges to the Theory of Eternalism 6.1 A Series Objections to Eternalism While eternalism may be mind-bending and intriguing, it's not without its fair share of critics. One of the main objections to eternalism comes from the A-series view of time. The A-series perspective sees time as a linear progression, with events unfolding in a particular order, past, present, and future. In contrast, eternalism argues that all moments in time exist simultaneously. This clash between the A-series and eternalism poses a challenge for proponents of the latter. Critics argue that eternalism's denial of the flow of time contradicts our subjective experience of the world. We feel time passing, and we perceive events unfolding one after another. From this viewpoint, eternalism seems to be at odds with our everyday experience of time. 6.2 Subjective Experience and the Reality of Passage Another criticism of eternalism revolves around our subjective experience of time's passage. We all know the feeling of time flying by or dragging on, yet eternalism suggests that these experiences are mere illusions. Critics argue that our subjective experience of time cannot be easily dismissed. It shapes our perception of reality and influences how we understand the world. The theory of eternalism, in its attempt to provide a comprehensive account of time, may overlook the significance of our personal experiences and the meaning we attach to the passage of time. 6.3 Metaphysical and Epistemological Critiques of Eternalism Metaphysical and epistemological critiques of eternalism also contribute to the ongoing debate surrounding this theory. Some argue that eternalism's assertion of the existence of all moments in time simultaneously raises questions about causality and the possibility of free will. Additionally, from an epistemological standpoint, critics question how we can have knowledge of future events if they already exist. If the future is just as real as the present and past, how can we claim to have genuine knowledge about what is to come? These objections emphasize the need for further exploration and refinement of the theory of eternalism. As it grapples with philosophical challenges related to the nature of time, our subjective experiences, and our understanding of reality. 7. Applications of Eternalism in Physics and Cosmology 7.1 Eternalism and the Theory of Special Relativity Eternalism doesn't just stir up philosophical debates, it also finds practical applications in the realms of physics and cosmology. One area where eternalism aligns itself nicely is with the theory of special relativity. Special relativity, formulated by none other than Albert Einstein, proposes that time is not absolute but rather relative to the observer's frame of reference. This notion fits snugly with eternalism's idea of all moments in time coexisting, regardless of our individual perspectives. According to special relativity, time can stretch and bend depending on the presence of mass or velocity. This flexibility in the nature of time aligns well with the eternalist view that all moments in time exist simultaneously, regardless of how we perceive their passage. 7.2 Implications for Quantum Mechanics and the Arrow of Time Quantum Mechanics, the fascinating realm of the tiniest particles, also finds some intriguing connections with eternalism. In the quantum world, particles can exist in multiple states simultaneously, not unlike the way eternalism suggests all moments in time exist concurrently. Furthermore, eternalism challenges our understanding of the arrow of time, the concept that the forward direction of time is distinct from the reverse. In eternalism, the arrow of time is more like a flowing river, with no clear distinction between past, present, and future. 
This raises provocative questions about the nature of causality and whether there is an underlying order to events. 7.3 Eternalism and the Big Bang Theory Last but certainly not least, Eternalism offers an intriguing lens through which to view the Big Bang Theory. The Big Bang, which postulates the origin of the universe from a singularity, aligns with Eternalism's notion that all moments in time exist simultaneously. In conclusion, the theory of Eternalism challenges our conventional understanding of time, offering a different perspective that has far-reaching implications in philosophy, physics, and beyond. By contemplating the nature of time, the concept of a timeless block universe, and the implications for free will and personal identity, we begin to navigate the complexities of Eternalism. While criticisms and debates persist, the applications of Eternalism in the realm of physics and cosmology continue to inspire further exploration and research. As we delve deeper into this theory, we are reminded that the nature of time is not a mere abstraction but an enigma that continues to captivate and challenge our understanding of existence.